with EA releasing the new MVPs and their prices not as high as we all thought they would be, like the initial, uh, you know, the initial part of when they first started doing it, when, you know, cards were coming out, they were like 800, 900, like for instance, you know, Jalen Smith and stuff like that. Now their prices have been greatly reduced. Some of you guys are asking the best use for scouting points right now, because would it make sense for me to go now and start playing with the 97 overall, knowing that, you know, all I'm going to get is possibly at most 500K, or should I just play around with the 80 plus overall with a certain amount and just know that I have a certain amount that I would need to get back to that 32K? I'm going to talk to you guys in a second about uh, all the scouting points, some of the additions that we're going to be adding right now, and more after this. All right, so the first thing that we're going to do is this. I'm going to go over here. We're going to look at, you see that team builder, Justin Tucker, bro? We're going to go over here, and I'm going, to, I'm going to just show you guys what we need to do right now. Now, this is one of the reasons why I try to make sure I update you guys as often as possible, because some of you guys don't realize that the prices are going to fluctuate based on the cards that EA newly releases. Like, all these kickers. You see how Justin Tucker got another kicker, like, another kicker card? This right here, like his kick power is a 94 right here. He goes to a 96 and an 80 speed and all kinds of other weird stuff, right? But just peep this though. This football outsider card, it like you see how it's a 93? You guys have to start to evaluate that stuff. I just want to point that out uh, while we get into the scouting because it all has to do with the same thing. When you're trying to build up your team to, you know, be like a 99 overall, you know, at one point throughout the year, once everything starts coming out. You got to know how to invest in certain cards. So look, let's let's go ahead and take a look at it because I want to show you really quickly uh, with the overall prices of the um, the MVPs. Why, when you're looking at my scouts, I'm at two million coins right now, right? So yesterday I was a little less. I, I forgot how much I made off of the pack opening. I had a very very good pack opening. Shout out to EA Sports for that. But this is the situation, right? The team MVPs, they're all the way down to 409. So look, what's going to happen is they're going to start dropping below that. So the gamble is, and the real swerve to make the most coins, would be to play around uh, actually with the, um, the 80 overall sets. Because you gambling with so many scouting points to just get that minimum doesn't make any sense. You might as well gamble with a portion of it and see what could come out of it. You know what I'm saying? So we got 35. We were going to play around and see what we could do with like a 32, 5, whatever. But all the cards are so cheap, we don't have a ceiling. If we play around with the 80s, though, if we play around with the 80 plus overalls, now we got a ceiling. Because if we pull 97s out of that, we're not really spending anything. And I think that that might be the better move. But let's go ahead and take a look at this first. We're going to go, what are they? They're kickers, right? Is it the combine kickers? Let's go over here. We're going to check. Um, he's a 95. And he's a kicker. So let's see what we could get out of that. Oh, none? Really? So what? what is that? That's not... I thought that was considered... What? Did, oh, they're team builders. They're team builders. All right, my bad. they all quick sell for scouting points. But yeah, you got to be specific. So let's go to team builders. All right, so now uh, Greg Zerline is a 94. What is his kick power? It should be higher than the other guys, right? A 96 also? That doesn't seem right. How is his, how is his a 96 also? And Justin Tucker is a 96? That just seems weird. Because you already know Greg the leg, though. That dude is booting it from Mars. All right, it doesn't really matter. But let's go take a look at this, right? We're going to go 93, and we're going to see what the value of this is. Because this is another pointer that you guys have to understand. When you're dealing with stuff like this, you got to know how to upgrade and get a portion back of what you're spending. That's like the key. So look, he's 103K right now, right? So look. This is what we're going to do. We know we know that he's at we're going to spend 200. So at least we get get 99k back. Why why is this important for what I'm showing you? Let me go let me go uh, break it down for you real quick. That's a 93 so you're going to get a certain amount of training points for that. And the reason that people are selling it for that cheap is because th nobody needs that kicker anymore because there's a new card. So they're going to get rid of it for whatever price, you know, they think is real, you know, realistic for it even though that's a lot of training points because if you look at this Right here, okay, let me, let me, why don't, okay, I got to take that off of him, and I'm going to show you his training point value for the 93. Let's go ahead and take that off, because we had the slow kicker thing on him. So let's take that off, downgrade him, so that way we could see what he quick sells for. Now look, that's 6,400 training for 100K, right? Now if you go through the regular setup, you're not going to find 93s around that rate so often. You're going to have to like siphon through. So pretty much like this, what we do is we go ahead and we try to get rid of him for 99, right? And then we're going to buy the other one for 200 That way we don't really lose anything. You're, well, we're losing half. You know what I'm saying? But in certain cases, 
you, it's better to actually keep the card because you're not going to get enough back to actually upgrade. Unless it's a skill position, don't really do wild things like that. You see, because I can, I can deal with spending 100K because I already know that I'm going to find other ways to make coins and that extra kick power is going to help me start ra like ranging them from like 60 because that's all you really need to hit it from 60. So that's why I'm going to get the 96 kick power because that's really, really huge for what the team, you know what I'm saying, for, for the team and everything. It just makes it better because now I can get to the 43 and know I can make a 60-yarder, a, a and it's just easier for me to do it that way. And I wanted to make sure you guys understood that. So let's go back over. We're going to get him. He's a 95. Um, he's still with the Ravens, right? Is he still with the Ravens? Because, I, you know, sometimes I just go all the way in depth to make sure that everything is copacetic. Now, nah, like, it is. What, all right, so he's 212. All right, he's a 96 kick power. He got pretty decent kick accuracy. Whatever. We're going to buy him, all right, and then we'll wait for that 99K or whatever, and then we'll go from there. Um, it is always good to make sure that clutch kicker is on them though. You know what I'm saying? And then also keep in mind that's 200 K for 15,000 scouts. When before that 200 K we were getting 94 overall other cards and it was a little bit, um, it was a little bit more. So now because of the way the market is, you can actually gamble a little bit more with the scouts trying to pull an MVP and make out with that as well. All right. So we're going to, we're going to also upgrade him. Um, we're going to add the same thing that we had on them before because the clutch kicker is just so much better because you don't have to worry about, you know, anything being crazy. The folk, Well, I thought it was clutch, but the clutch is not the clutch is just not to get iced. This one right here is better because it gives you the, the pro difficulty. But then now that I'm thinking about it, when I play draft champions, you know, what I'm saying like I have to get used to it back again. It don't matter. We're going to go with focus kicker because that's what worked all the time. So we'll leave that with him and then we'll just equip him in the lineup and that, you know, that'll be it for it. So now we just upgraded our kick power. And we're gonna get back, we're gonna get back uh, half of what we spent for him, just because we waited a little bit longer than other people would have waited. But now, look, we just we just spent two twelve. He's at two thirty six. Why is that? Because people want to make coins because they know that people are gambling with scouting points. And as long as people are willing to gamble with scouting points, you have an opening. You just have to know what's going on. So now that all that is said and done, and I just gave you a little bit more pointers with making coins. Now we're gonna get down to the nitty gritty. All right, so let's go back over here. Just make sure everything is in the right way. And then we're going to go open up. We're going to open up a decent, we're going to open up 10 packs. I like to keep it to 10. And then if I don't get anything, I walk away with my head down and EA got me that day. You know what I'm saying, bro? EA got me. Everything is all good. We're done. That It is what it is. Also, keep in mind, the kicker, special teams counts towards your overall. So every time you raise your overall, um, you should try to look to see what your kicker overall is. Like when you start adding other players in and then you see how you got, I got to a 97, we're going to have to raise these guys up to be able to get to the 98, 99. You know what I'm saying? We might need, we might even need like a 98, 99 kicker. They might have to do something like that because that's what they did last year when they started making an account. So I just wanted to point that out as well. Now, ultimately where we are right now, we have 35,000 scouts. I've showed you what the market looks like. Now it's on us to try to gamble and see what's really good. So we're going to go into the store and we're going to pull 10. All right. So 10 of them is going to bring us down to like 24. But we know that we could gain a decent amount of scouting points to get us right back to 32 if that was necessary. But we're playing with house money because we got our monthly rewards from Weekend League and all of those scouts were free. So we got 33,000 scouting points for free. And now we're just going to gamble with it. So before we get into it, I'm going to need you guys to go ahead and bless the packs. You know what you're doing. Regular routine. Ooh, la mia, hoo -yi, hoo -yi. No. All right, let's do it. Now, we're going to do 10. If they give us an MVP, we're running away with our head down. If they give us an MVP early. More than likely, like I said, they're going to start off with the 80. They're going to play around with us a little bit, but it doesn't really matter. Once we get to like the 20-somethings, because I know I can get 10, you know, 10K easy as far as the, um, you know, what the prices are going right now for the team builders. So I'll get right back to 32 if I wanted to just go at, oh. Oh, I saw a little star in there. Oh, it's still an 80? still an 80, though. But I saw a little star in there. Bro, why would they let me go to upgrade? You know, like, bro, who would ever upgrade that guy? Like, if you're running around with this card right here that I just pulled for any reason and you're not Arden Key, then you're an idiot. Like, bro, it's just what it is. Like, it's just straight factuals. Like, why would you be running around with him ever on your team? Like, why would they think I wanted to upgrade that guy at any time? Like, for what reason would they ever think that I wanted to do that? Oh, oh, the screen got mad dark. I thought, they, you see, the, now they're trolling. Now they're trolling me. They're trolling me now, bro. They really just gave that to me twice. They're trolling me heavy right here. They're trolling me real heavy. Like, it's just, it just doesn't make any sense at all. This is just really, really ridiculous. Why would they do that, bro? 
Yo, give me, okay, that, what is this? This is number four? Okay, 86, that's not bad. That's 660. All right, put us back up, 31. Not bad, not bad. All right, let's keep it moving. Let's see what we got here. Let's see what's going on. We got we got to be able to do something that's going to give us the right amount, though. Like, if we can't get the right number, dog, like, right there. Not 83, all right. Not bad, not bad, bro. Not bad. Not bad, bro. Like, all right, so they, they, they playing with me right now. EA playing with me. But once we get down, like I said, bro, I'm only trying to pull 10. Because this is ultimately the only way you can come up with these stupid prices is to gamble with this one. Everything else that you're trying to do is more than likely not going to work. Because if I go play around with that other set that I initially wanted to, once I waited out to see, like, if I pull a Mike Evans, bro, like, I could get the 500 off of Mike Evans, but it's going to be up there for a while. But if we start gambling with this and just pull one MVP, we change the game. Even if I don't pull an MVP, like this 87, that's not bad, dog, like to pull an 87. But again, if we're not getting in the 90 ranges, then it's a failure. It's absolutely a failure, bro. But, th but these packs right here, these packs, without a doubt, will let you accumulate the most coins. Like no matter what else you're spending on. But I do believe that they nerfed it a lot, though. They definitely nerfed this a lot. Because I was pulling MVPs like it's nobody's business. And um, I waited until they released some of the newer ones before I even initiated doing this again. So I don't even know what they're doing right now. But it makes no sense, dog. Like, seriously. Like, what is this? All right, come on, come on, come on. Bro, are you... Yo, all right, so I don't know how many more we have left because we did get a couple that was helping us out before we got to... Um, we got an 80, what, an 87 or something like that? So we got, we got a decent amount that actually puts us up over what we were supposed to have. But again... Okay, yo, bro, whatever, EA, whatever, 86. See, they're playing with us. That's what EA is doing. They, they want me to know that they don't want to give me nothing good, but I should stop possibly and just go with the other one. But can I pull it? I don't think the limited ones are any... The limited ones are no longer available. We're not going down below 25, though. We pulled more than enough. What is this? Okay, 81. Bro, there's a lot of bums. There's a, there's a lot of bums in this. All right, we going out of... Bro, 25 or we going down to 20? What are we doing? I don't know what we're doing, but I'm not wasting on my free... My free, um... Thing that my free scouting points, bro. Like I'm not doing that. Like I know when to stop. EA is out here playing games. EA is playing games with me, dog. Like all right, 25. All right, we still. Mm. Yeah, today might not be our day, though. Like real talk, today might not be our day. So we might have to back off. We might have to back off from this. We might have to. Like the way that EA is trying to do me straight up dry right here, we might have to back up. All right, yeah, we. we 80. Okay, because I saw the sideline go. All right, so that's 1920. So that gives us another two. Because I really, like, if we get down, all right, what is that? That's 32.5, right? Yeah. So if we go down to about 20, all right, 20 is our limit. 20 is our limit right here. If we could get one MVP, EA, one MVP out of all of this. And most of you guys that are watching this video right now, you probably already pulled the MVP. Because that's how I do for my viewers, dog. Like, if you've never pulled anything good, try pulling packs while you're watching any of my vids. Like, you're going to get something glitchy. That's just the way it goes because I'm giving you that energy right here. Even though EA is abusing me right here, you're probably not going to get abused the way I'm getting abused. Why are they giving me this guy so much? Why are they giving me that guy? Why, what, what's so special about that idiot that they keep they keep giving him over? Bruh, why do they keep doing it? That's all I want to know. Why do, well, how many times have I pulled that card? Like, EA has to be trolling right now. This is, okay, another 88. Like, they trolling, but they giving me a decent amount. But I already told you, my cutoff is 20K. So once we get there, that's it. Like, I'm done. It don't really matter, dog. Like, it, every, it's a wrap from there. So whatever EA wants to do, they could do it right now. Whatever. Let's go. What do we got? More garbage? Just one MVP, bruh. One MVP is all I'm looking for. That's it. You give me one MVP, I walk away. I don't say nothing about nothing, and I'm good. But they don't want to give it to me, though. They don't want to give it to... Bruh, yo. I think what I'm going to... You know what I'm going to do, guys? Yeah, all right. Let me get this MVP. Oh, yes! Yeah, yes! How much is that? 76. All right, we go back to 30. All right, we at 31. Should I just walk away right here or should I do one more? Because, like, right now, nah, I'm walking away. All right, so I don't win and I don't lose. I don't win and I don't lose, but you guys, whatever you choose to do, like, what, what do we, we got we to gotta get 99K back, right? So, look, this is what, this is what we're going to do because I'm not playing with EA. That 93, we pulled so many to get that 193. I'm going to go ahead and take a pause. Maybe they'll reset it and we'll be back for more. But, look, we are so close to the 32.5. So still, we still got a free 500K in the bank just chilling. You know what I'm saying? Because even if we have to re-roll to get the one player that's like, you know what I'm saying, at that price, we still Gucci. So it don't matter. Either way, we win. And that's the point. You can't let EA beat you. So look, 
that that kicker is going to sell for 99 because he's a high enough overall with worth the, you know that training point value so that's a done deal and then we're still right there so we chilling right now you know what i'm saying don't set trip. We pulled a lot of 87s, 89s, 93s. I need you guys to try it out as well. But make sure you have a limit on it. Your limit is 10. If EA does you dirty, and remember, that 10 includes quick selling everything else off. So if you can sell stuff off and still keep yourself around a certain amount of scouts, just keep doing it. But we're going to win at this. At, most of us are winning. Some of us are going too far. That's why we're losing. Let's just get that balance, and we're going to be Gucci, all right? I'm going to see you guys and girls next time. Thank you so much for joining me for this pack opening. So much more to come. Let me know what you would like to see on the channel. Also, subscribe to GMods World Gaming while you're at it and GMods World Podcast. I'm going to see you guys and girls next time. One love.